Hello everyone, my name is Anubis Lives and I'm your VTuber Senpai. In today's video, we're gonna go over on how to be a PNG tuber, a PNG VTuber, and a reactive image VTuber. All these are the exact same, but sometimes people look for them underneath different names. PNG tubing has been getting more popular. In fact, many top streamers like Seadog VA, Iron Mouse, Mori Calliope have been doing it in their particular streams. In fact, being a PNG tuber actually saves you 10 to 20% in CPU resources because programs like Luppet and VC Face don't actually have to be used. So if you have a potato of a PC, you can actually use this for your streams. If you like today's video, make sure you like and subscribe. That does help me greatly in the algorithm. I also upload on this YouTube channel every Wednesday. I also stream on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So I would love for you to come on by and say hi. Links for my Twitch and all my social media down below. All right, let's get into it. First thing we're gonna need is a image of your particular model. So if you know how to draw, I would draw your model. If not, you can ask your mom, your dad, your brother, your sister, your goldfish. If you have none of those options, consider asking a friend. If you don't have any friends, that's okay. I got you covered. What you can do is head to fiverr.com. You can commission artists for around $5. Okay, so now that we got our image taken care of, let's head to Discord. Once in Discord, you're gonna go to the little gear on the bottom left-hand side called user settings. Once there, you're going to go to advanced Advance. Once out of advance, you're going to just check on developer mode. But we are not done in Discord just quite yet. We got to do one more thing. So, here once again in Discord, what we got to do is make ourselves a private channel. What we got to do is click on this little plus sign that says create channel. What you got to do is make one text, one voice, and then check off private channel. You're going to need both. And the reason for that is basically you're going to need one for your little images and one for your private room where you can drag people into that doesn't really disturb your stream. And now that's done, we're gonna to head to a particular website. Website we're gonna to go to is streamkit.discord.com forward slash overlay. A link for this will be in the description bar down below. What we're gonna do is we're gonna click on voice widget. We're gonna click on server. We're gonna select our server. Voice channel, we're gonna go all the way down to Anubis's room. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna check off hide names and we're gonna copy this link. Now with that copy link, we're gonna head right on over to OBS. Okie dokie, here in OBS, what we wanna do now is under sources, we wanna click on the little plus sign. We're gonna to go to browser. We're gonna call it PNG Tuber. Then our URL that we just copied, we're gonna paste it in the URL section. The width, we're going to change to 1920 and our height to 1080 or the resolution that you're currently working with. Then we're going to click OK. OK, so now that all that's done, we're going to head to another website and finish this up. Okie dokie, before we go to that website, what we want to do is we want to right click on our user and we want to copy its ID. Then we're going to go to this website, Jin.com forward slash Discord Reactive Image Generator. Link for this will be in the description down below. We're gonna scroll down about halfway. Discord ID, we're gonna paste it into here. Then we're gonna go back to Discord. We're gonna need two copies of our image. We're gonna right click on the first image and we're gonna click copy link. We're gonna enter this into the website that says non-speaking image URL. Then back at Discord one more time, we're gonna copy the other image link. We're gonna paste it in here and then click paste. Then we're gonna hit generate. We're gonna scroll down a little bit, then we're gonna copy this entire code and we're gonna paste that into OBS. Okay, so here in OBS, we need to right click on our little PNG tuber browser source. We're gonna go down to properties. Then under custom CSS, that code that we just copied, we're gonna paste it in there and deleting the old one. Then we're gonna click okay. And as you see, we now appear on the screen. Now we can actually adjust us to whatever size we want and whatever position on the screen we want. And just like that, we're ready to go. But a quick note, I wanna tell all of you is you gotta make sure that you're joined inside that Discord channel. But what we can also do is add as many friends as we want. All you gotta do is exact same steps. You can add all your friends' images to that private text channel, have them join that private Discord channel, and follow the steps as you saw on the screen prior. You gotta make sure though that they have their own separate browser source then you can actually have as many as you want on the screen. But there is one more thing we gotta do. I wanna give credit to Jen. He is the grandfather or the father of PNG tubing. I scoured the internet high and low for multiple hours per day for the past week. No one, and I mean no one, has had this code available for everybody to use. 
So I want to say thank you to Jen for making this possible for the VTubing community to use. If you haven't checked out Jin's channel, this is his channel right here. A link to his channel will be in the description down below. His original video covering this has over 155K at the time of this video being made. So I highly suggest you go subscribe to him and thank him for what we've done today. So my fellow VTubers, PNG tubers, and any kind of other tubers all around the world, I hope this really helps you to not really need to rely on applications like VUP, Luppet, VC Face, so on and so forth. This now gives you the freedom and endless possibilities to do any kind of, well, PNG tubing. Again, my name is Anubis Lives. I stream on Twitch every Monday, Wednesday, Friday. I would love for you to come on by, say hi. Let's talk about PNG tubing, V tubing, and well, whatever. And well, I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.